dog in the window. What, can you see him? Yeah. Well, he's a poor dog. Right. 10 to 9, 29th of January. We're off to get the gearbox fitted. Well, deliver it so he can fit the uh, reconditioned gearbox. And we will show you why it needs to be done. It's got, let's say, 86,000 miles on it. Some people would say that's not a lot for a, a Borg Warner box, but it was a little bit abused when we bought the car. I didn't realise, but the kickdown cable was frayed. Well, the pressure control cable was frayed when we bought the car and um, it was running at high pressure all the time and it does do things to the bands so we pull away normally hang on that's, that's lights we don't want lights we do not want lights we want wipers there we go here we go humber power there we get nice gear changes when the gearbox is cold and the oil is nice and thick so once it's warmed up a bit let me feel it there better than ours. Once it's warmed up, um, I wish it was third gear, I will show you what is wrong with it. So I'll catch you up in just a second. Right, we're on our way. It's taking us ages to get this far. The traffic's been really bad today. So if we get to this junction here, and I will show you, you have to keep your ears open, what this does once the oil's got warm, once it's done a few miles, if I give it some beans, then we're going downhill, it might not. Ready? There we go. I know a lot of you will say, oh, just second the, the brake band on second gear. It has been adjusted as far as it will go. So if I'm gentle with it, we'll ignore that. If we're gentle with it, and just as it's about to change gear, I just let off just a little bit, I can get away with it. But if I need to get away in a hurry, or if I'm on a bit of a hill, it does that every time. So we're gonna get it fixed. At the bus station, ready to go home. Gate 12 is like being in an airport, so we'll be home in an hour or so, and then the next little film will be picking it back up again. As the bloke said, a couple of days, so hooray! Thank you. 